Hey guys, Magnus Robert here, bringing you another video. This one gonna, we're going to be doing a, a brand new series that I'm bringing to my channel. It's kind of latched onto the ideas a little bit, but I want to talk about completing categories. So this is com completing categories episode one, if you want. Uh, this is the Simpsons slash Bouvier family. Uh, now the Simpsons is what primarily is what it is, but I just thought I'd latch on the Bouvier family because, of course, they are linked, and you know, there's not very many. Uh, Bouvier families they've missed really there's only three so I thought I may as well lit, lit, uh, latch it on so of course these are the main ones for each category so we have obviously Homer, Marge, Bart, Lisa, Grandpa and uh, or Abraham uh, and uh, uh, Maggie and then obviously we have Selma, Patty and uh, Jacqueline uh, so they those are the main ones uh, uh, well the main ones in those categories but then there's also these ones as well so we've got uh, Mona Simpson, we've got Herb Powell, we've got, uh, these are the future Simpsons, obviously they are just Bart, Lisa and Maggie, but uh, we also have obviously Santa's Little Helper and uh, uh, Snowball 2, and we have Amber Simpson, which is Homer's ex-wife, Vegas wife, uh, and we have Hugo, who's a non-canon character, but uh, is meant to be Bart's evil twin. Uh, but he's obviously non-canon. I'm including non-canon in this as well, by the way, because uh, of course technically these futuristic characters are technically non-canon as well. I'm not too sure if I've missed any. Please comment if I have. I don't don't include pets though. I mean, I, I wasn't going to go for all the little pets that they've had that are in the game. Um, anyway, uh, so these are Abe's siblings. These are his uh, the main sort of ones I think they should have first. Now Cyrus Simpson is the one I definitely want them to have, which is Abe's Abraham, uh, is a, uh, the grandpa's brother. Uh, of course, he is actually in the Christmas episode. He's only in that episode where we see him and and uh, the story with him and I just think it would be kind of nice to add him in to Christmas because it's Christmas is a nice time of year when they add Simpsons characters for example Maggie so I think Cyrus would be pretty cool if they did add him in there um, uh, then we have also Tyrone Simpson this is another one of his brothers uh, there's only in really one episode where the Simpsons were celebrating his birthday uh, we have Chet Simpson he's actually a younger brother he's like a really really younger brother uh, uh, it's not well. It's implied he's a brother. It's it's, it's not one hundred percent sure if he is uh, the brother. But basically, Homer does say that to Lisa, this is your great uncle, which implies that probably it it, it, it is um, uh, Abraham's brother. It could be another sort of great uncle, I guess. But it probably is just like a younger brother. And then we have Hortense Simpson. This is again the non-canon uh, non-canon ones, like a fairy sort of Marge. I, I don't really know what the Simpson what episode this is from, but Hortense. This is a uh, it's non-canon, but is Abraham's sister or Abe Simpson's sister. So they could throw her in there as well. So they're the main siblings. Uh, and then we have Abe's other family. This is the uh, the other character I really wanted to add. And this is Abby. This is Abraham. This is Abe's daughter and Homer's half sister. And of course, this is uh, Edwina, which is a, uh, Abby's mother. And that was obviously also Abe's lover in World War Two. So that that's one I definitely think they should add. They should definitely add her. Maybe it's like a. Uh, they don't have to add her, but I definitely want them to add Abby at least, because of course she is quite a big Simpson. They haven't they forgot about because obviously this is Homer's half sister, which I think is pretty important. To uh, so yeah, um, then we have now this is the least of the Simpson ep uh, episode. So in this episode, we saw many Simpsons, uh, Simpson like relatives, and this isn't all of them. These are just the notable ones that Homer points out. The, ho the ones that Homer points out. Um, you know when Lisa's a bit down on the fact that uh, her family's not very successful, and Homer sort of re re sort of reassures her. You know, there there are some. There are some. Um, and Chet was in this group of people. But Chet has... Uh, Chet is a bit more significant, I think. But we have the suing relative. Obviously, this is a relative who sued a lot of people and got his wealth from that. Uh, we have the hurt leg relative. He obviously comes late and he's got a hurt leg or something like that. Uh, millionaire actor relative. This is the one. Obviously, this is quite a very successful one. Who's a, he's an actor. And they could add this one. I think these two are ones you could probably leave out. Uh, maybe maybe non-playable. I don't know. Uh, we have prison snitch relative. This is... Um, one that Homer talks about. Uh, we have the beggar relative again, another, another forgettable one. Stanley Simpson. This one did have a little bit of a more backstory. I'm forget exactly what Homer says, but I think he looks cooler personally. That's why I want. Oh, sorry. That's why I want to add him. And then the last one is Doctor Simpson. This is the main one because this is. Um, 
she's appeared twice. Uh, more a bit notable. Uh, I think it's Homer's cousin. Not too sure though. It's not 100% confirmed how he's how she's related to Homer. But she is like this successful doctor. And I just think that she'd be a really, really cool one to add. So this is the one I definitely... Out of all these ones here, this is the one I definitely want them to add Doctor Simpson. She hasn't actually got an action name, which is a bit, bit annoying. I like it when they have names, you know. Uh, but whatever. Uh, so yeah. Um... So that's all those were ones. And then we have the 19th century Simpsons. So these are Simpsons uh, from the past. Blast from the past. So um, I'll start off with Abraham Simpson the first. This is actually Grandpa's grandfather. Of course, you don't see him in his adult film. But this is actually Grandpa's grandfather. So um, think of it like that. Uh, now, this... And then, so... Uh, grandpa's gr actually this might be his great grandfather but anyway grandpa's great great I'm not too sure if they're great great or just one great but great great or great grandparents are Mabel Simpson and Virgil Simpson so of course these are his uh, sort of relatives now Mabel uh, sh this, let's just say this is his great so this is um, Homer's great great grandmother and Homer's great great grandfather now uh, Virgil uh, sorry Mabel used to be married to Hiram Simpson uh, but she kept the name Simpson. Uh, but she used to be named uh, Hiram Simpson, who was like the sort of the main person who t who w had the Simpsons name, I guess. Uh, Hiram Simpson, and he uh, with Mabel had Eliza Simpson. So technically, uh, Eliza is related. She is like a, an aunt, I guess, a great great aunt, a half aunt. Uh, he Hiram technically isn't related, I guess, not to their family anyway. Uh, so yeah. But he's just next husband. So there you go. There you go. But they could add all these guys in. I think they would. That would work. Um, would be pretty cool. So yeah. And then we have the future Simpsons. Um. So first of all, we have. Uh, see, these are Simpsons that uh, basically are in the future. They don't exist. They're not technically on. They're technically uncanon. Uh, they exist in the in the future episodes where we see uh, Bart and Lisa and all that uh, have a family. So the first one is Zia Simpson. This is uh, uh, Lisa and Milhouse's daughter. Of course, uh, she's like this sort of rebellious teenager. So I think she'd be a pretty one cool one to add. And I definitely want to see all these characters, or at least these four. Uh, maybe not this one, but uh, I want to see all these f in when they do a part two of the sci-fi. I'm saying when they do a part two because they bloody better do a part two. Uh, they missed out so much stuff, and it's just perfect to make a, a part two. Um, and then we have Gender Sim uh, Gender Simpson. So this is actually Bart's uh, future wife or future ex-wife, I should say, uh, that he was married to, but then I think they got divorced. Uh, they broke up. Uh, and then he these are Bart's two kids and Gender's kids, uh, Kirk and Picard Simpson. Um, so they're definitely vital to add. Uh, pretty cool characters. And then the final one is Maggie Simpson Jr. Uh, we see Maggie basically have this child. We're not too sure who the father is for the child. It could be a potential. It looks like a <laughs> Maggie in the future is a bit of a... Uh, uh, um, a village bicycle, as, as uh, I would say. <laughs> but uh, she has uh, Maggie Simpson Jr., who um, Marge does dress up in the uh, classical Maggie attire, but she is seen, first of all, in this kind of like pink uh, uh, blanket. So I guess they could add her with the pink blanket so she crawls around like normal Maggie. I guess that would be kind of cool. They could do that. Maybe it's like a non playable, actually. Yeah, non playable, I think that would work. Um, so these are homes of the families. These are just sort of mis miscellaneous ones. So we have a Valerie. Togaski Rothman, and this is Homer's cousin. Uh, uh, and then she gets married to a guy called Dave, and that's him now. I just thought I'd latch him on. Uh, we have um, the, this is the very first Homer, so this is home. This is probably the furthest back in terms of relatives uh, we've got for the Simpsons family. So this is um, a guy who lived in um, um, Jerusalem or Israel, lived in Israel um, in two, in uh, twelve thousand, uh, twelve thousand and twenty BC. You uh, know. 1220 BC uh, and this is like I just called I just titled him first Homer but he technically he was like sort of I guess confirmed by Homer himself that he is a relative of Homer um, so they could add him I guess that technically is a Simpsons uh, family a very distant one I pro he probably didn't have the name Simpson then but you know uh, whatever um, and then we have Rita La now this is Abe's wife. I'm not too sure if it's Abe's ex. I'm not too sure. I've not seen this episode. I'm not sure if they uh, actually get uh, divorced or not. But uh, Abraham, uh, Abe apparently gets married to her, and one wiki lists her as still his wife, and then one wiki lists her as an ex-wife. So I'm not too sure what's going on there. But there's her anyway. 
I'm not too sure if she's still married to him though. And then we have or uh, is it Orville? Orville Simpson. Uh, this is Abraham's father, uh, or Homer's grandfather. I think it's Orville. Um, of course, I think this would be a really really cool one to add if they added him. Maybe into like um, some sort of Chris. Maybe the Christmas event they could add him there, I guess. But maybe they do some sort of family related event or something like that. Or anywhere. Where, oh, the, maybe even a sci-fi update because you could just throw him in there and say, look, we went to the past and we 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 retrieved this guy. They could do that. I think that would work and that would be pretty cool. But I definitely want to see a sci-fi too because there's so many so much stuff from. Just these characters they can add. Um, and then we have pets. Now, pets is a little bit of a weird one because, honestly, they, they, they can do a lot of things with pets. These, this might not be all the pets, but I've got the notable ones anyway, or at least the ones I think are notable. Uh, so, first of all, they had the episode... Now, we have Snowball 1, of course. Uh, prior to The Simpsons, Snowball 1's dead. I think they should add Snowball 1 as a character in Halloween. I, I've said this for a while. I think maybe as, like, a ghost would be kind of cool, or just the, the thing itself. Maybe they can add it so it's, like, rotting or something. Even if they just add the cat itself and say, you know, she rose it from the dead because that was what uh, Lisa tried to do in that episode where she raised all the zombies she uh, initially tried to raise Snowball 1 so they could do that um, and of course they had the episode where Snowball 2 died and um, Lisa obviously tried to replace Snowball uh, Snowball 2 um, and then she basically all those cats died and she settled for Snowball 5 at the end who looks exactly the same uh, Snowball 2 now technically in the game um, and hear me out on this so I think they should add Snowball 2 and they should add Snowball 4 or Colt Coltrane, Coltrane, or whatever. Uh, they should add those two. But hear me out when I say they should add Snowball 5. Because the current Snowball we have, Snowball 2, doesn't have tasks. What they could do is, alternatively, they could just give Snowball 2 tasks. Or they could give Snowball 5 tasks. Because technically this episode is still canon. And the cat currently, although Lisa calls it Snowball 2, she just calls it Snowball 2 for the for uh, you know the sake of, uh, for argument's sake. I think, why not just call it Snowball 5? Or even just call... It, um, well, yeah, just call it Snowball 5 and give it a bunch of tasks. I don't see why they couldn't do that. I think that would work out. So this one has tasks. Maybe these two could have tasks, I guess. They didn't have to, though. Uh, but they could leave Snowball 2 without tasks then, and that would work out for me, and I'd be fine with that. Uh, but that's just, a, that's just a potential. And then we have Pinchy. I really want them to re actually add the physical Pinchy. Of course, they did the whole thing with him in the Superheroes update, and you can get a costume for the factory where you have a, a huge Pinchy destroying it. But the problem is I want an actual Pinchy, you guys. I want a Pinchy walk running around, our, skidding around our town. Uh, we have Santa's Little Helpers puppies. They could just add these as like one big character. That would be kind of cool. Um, yeah, there's, they all have individual names. There's a big list of them I wasn't going to put on here. And then we have Lou the cow, of course. Uh, a cow that obviously Bart doesn't want to be sent to the slaughterhouse. Um, they could add him when they add when they add the Mary Sp Spluck Spruckler uh, uh, thing for Valentine's Day because I expect they will do that one year at least they will surely one year when they do the Mary Spruck Spruckler thing with um, her they could potentially add Lou onto that and I think that would work it wouldn't really matter if they added um, you know it's related to that episode which is a sort of Valentine's Day themed episode or it's a love it's a love it's a romance themed episode so they could just add the cow in there they could throw him in there um, and then we have some more pets. We have Hen Hendrix. This is Homer's sort of old dog. Uh, she's the fastest. This is a dog that they sort of adopt for a little bit because obviously Santa Santa's little helper mates with her, and then that's what we get these puppies from. Uh, we have Strangles, which is Bart's uh, snake, not to be mixed up with uh, Lumpy. Uh, we have who's the school snake. Uh, we have. Uh, Lady, who's another dog they get, which she eventually goes to the police force. We have Princess. This is a horse that Lisa owns. Technically, this is a decoration in Spring uh, in Tapped Out at the minute, but I it wouldn't be it would be pretty cool if they actually added the character, even if it was non playable. Raymond Bird, the, he was only there briefly, uh, and he dies pretty quickly. So maybe they could just add that as a um, non playable. Uh, Bart Junior. This is one I definitely want to see as a non playable or a tappable character in the. Destination Springfield Part 2, which we're going to get next year. <laughs> no, I'm betting on it. I'm betting. We got the Oscar f flu this year, and I was thinking the the Australia thing with the, with the, the frogs in, infesting Australia, I think that's absolutely perfect for next year. <laughs> so I've, I, I I see that what, that's gonna, this is going to be a takedown character for the takedown Destination Part 2, I'm telling you. And then we have Smiley and Henry the Canary. These two are the, another pets that Lisa adopts in this episode, uh, but they could just throw them, them in as not playable they could do a whole thing with that episode because there's quite a few like little different animal sanctuaries and stuff they go to so they could they could maybe do a little mini event i might do a video on that but it would be mostly uh the only problem with that would be mostly um 
um, characters they'd be adding. <laughs> uh, yeah, but so Smiley and Henry the Canary, they could add Task, but it'd be probably better than non-playable, both of those guys. Uh, but they, I definitely want to see Task with Lady. I would definitely want to see some, probably with Princess, because she's been seen a couple times. But the rest could just be non-playable, and I wouldn't care. And then we have the Bouvier family. These are the last ones we've got. So these are the only briefly. So we got Clancy Bouvier, probably the biggest one, and the one I definitely think they should add. And they, I would have been, I wasn't, I was quite surprised they didn't add it with the airport because it would have kind of made sense, I guess. But they don't have to, I guess. It well, it, it is a stewardess anyway. Uh, so this is Clancy Bouvier. This is Marge's father. Uh, we don't really know very much about this character, and he's quite a mysterious one considering he's related to one of our biggest characters. You know, it's the father of essentially our secondary protagonist or third, third, third protagonist if you want to say. Uh, it's very it's very weird that we don't know very much about him. But um, there you go. He's there anyway. And then we have uh, Aval... Alvarine Gurn Gurney? Alvarine Gurney. Alvarine Gurney. I'm going with that. Uh, this is actually Mar Marge's grandmother. Uh, so Jacqueline Bouvier's mother. And the weird thing about this character is we don't know if she's dead or not. There is a potential she's still alive. A very slim potential, but a potential nonetheless. So that's kind of funny. And then we have... Uh, Gladys uh, Gurney, which is Marge's aunt. Of course, she dies uh, in the episode she's introduced, where she basically uh, the she went after she died. There's a tape uh, where it obviously gives out her will to Marge and Patty and Selma and her sister Jacqueline. So this is Marge's aunt and Jacqueline's sister. Uh, so those the, that is all the movie. That literally is all the Bouvier family. There isn't really any others. Um, you know, I definitely want them to add Clancy Bouvier. Uh, I'm not too bothered about the other two, to be honest with you. Uh, but it would be cool. To see the other two but i definitely want to see the mad clancy movie some some way down the line so that's it for episode one of our complete characters where we're talking about the simpsons and the bouvier family um tell me your thoughts on uh which which one of these characters you want to see maybe maybe just do like a top three out of all these characters the top three you want to see uh, or maybe like a, one on my slides, like do the top three slides you want to see. So you want to see Abe's sim siblings or Abe's, these, well, Abby basically, uh, or these guys, which honestly, these are the ones I, I, I would least want, to be honest with you. Uh, you know, they're just a bunch of lookalikes, really. Um, but yeah, that's all that. Next episode, we're going to be looking at Flanders' family. And we might be looking at, um, I might do Flanders and Arpu's family, I'm not too sure, I might just do Flanders, I'm not so sure, because this one is, is going to be longer than the usual ones are going to be, I'm going to try and keep these ones short, they're just easier ones I can do on top of ideas videos, and they don't, they don't, they, they're they they interesting to do, and they don't take as much effort for me, and I just, you know, if you guys enjoy it, I mean, if you don't enjoy it, and you're, you're not going to be interested, please do tell me, because if enough of you aren't interested in these kind of, in these kind of videos where I talk about categories, and not actual ideas, then yeah, I, I might just scrap this idea, but this is one I've, I, I think would be pretty cool, so tell me your thoughts, and I'll see you next video, goodbye.